It has always been thought that one day, AI machines will become so advanced that they can take over human roles in society. Well, with the announcement of PyBot, that day is here, and it's as exciting as it is scary. Hey guys, Ben here, and I hope you all are having a great day. In this video, I want to share some incredibly exciting information that is literally going to change the world as we know it. Recently, scientists from the Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology, or KAIST for short, have developed an AI robot that can fly planes. Yeah, you heard me right. In this video, I'll lay out everything that we know about this machine. And trust me, you won't miss a second of this one. So, without further ado, let's take a deeper look. So, this machine developed by KAIST actually has a name already. It's called PyBot, and here's how David Shim, the associate professor at electrical engineering at KAIST, described their creation. PyBot is a humanoid robot that can fly an airplane just like a human pilot by manipulating all the single controls in the cockpit, which is designed for humans. So, according to Kais, this thing can fly planes as well as an experienced pilot. This is a very bold claim indeed, and if true, will literally change the world as we know it. But how does something like this actually work? Well, to be honest, it's a bit complicated, but here's the basic picture. PyBot makes use of large language models to memorize intricate manuals about how to fly and improve its capability across a wide variety of aircraft types. The company has stated that its capacity is so big that it can store every Jeppesen Aeronautical Global Navigation Chart, a feat that no human has ever been able to accomplish. This basically means that PyBot is like that one smart kid who doesn't have to study for exams. While every other pilot has to spend years learning about different aircraft and navigation techniques, PyBot can simply learn all this information instantly using those large language models. PyBot also looks incredibly versatile. If it needs to fly a different plane, it can simply be programmed with the right instructions for that specific model, and be ready to fly a new plane with the same level as a human who's been flying the same plane for decades. This is all pretty impressive, right? And if you made it this far into the video, make sure to hit the subscribe button. PyBot is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to the content we've got planned for this channel, and I can assure you that you don't want to miss a single video. Another incredibly interesting feature of PyBot is how it makes use of AI. Throughout PyBot's development, AI systems have improved by leaps and bounds, giving KAIST greater opportunities to improve and adapt PyBot for the future. So, PyBot primarily relies on large language AI models, both to learn and execute actions. The company has stated that this AI-based model will enable PyBot to execute error-free flights, react to emergencies quicker than a human, and memorize emergency and operating manuals should anything go wrong. And what's more is that PyBot's AI training means that it can offer real-time calculations to pick the safest route that would avoid any potential hazards and accidents. Basically, KAIST is claiming that with this language model, PyBot will essentially be the equivalent of a superhuman pilot. Now, this AI language model will also be stored on board pilot's internal computer for easy access during flights. Oh, and did we mention that PyBot will be able to talk? Yeah, apparently KAIST is currently developing a voice synthesis system that will enable PyBot to communicate with air traffic controllers and other pilots. They really thought of everything here. Now this all sounds good, but a question you might be thinking about is, how does PyBot actually work? I mean, does it actually sit in the cockpit like actual humans? Well, surprisingly, yeah. PyBot has been designed as a robot that can seamlessly take a human's place and fit into a cockpit as a human would. Here's what David Shim said on the subject. PyBot is a humanoid robot that can fly an airplane just like a human pilot by manipulating all the single controls in the cockpit, which are designed for humans. This is a pretty smart move from KAIS, because it will mean that PyBot can actually be used in real-world scenarios. Instead of having to accommodate the robot, PyBot will simply be able to fit in the workspace as it currently stands, and not many current-gen robots can do this. So, the impressiveness of this claim really shouldn't be understated. Now, in a recent interview, Shim explained that PyBot is still currently in development, but this development should be finished by 2026. Now, let's take a second to think about what I just said. 2026 is only three years away. We could actually have robots flying us around the world as soon as three years from now. Now, there will probably be a massive adaptation period, along with a lot of commercial testing. But still, how crazy is it to think that all those sci-fi movies are actually becoming a reality? 
Ultimately, PyBot looks to be a bit of a game changer in the robotics and AI space, and is one of the first robots that we've seen that could actually have worldwide life-changing use. But then again, three years is a lifetime in the tech world. So by 2026, PyBot could actually be considered archaic compared to other models. As development continues, we'll learn more about this incredible machine, so make sure to subscribe for more updates. And of course, we'd love to get your opinion on PyBot, so drop us a line in the comments below. Do you believe Kais' claims? Or is this, once again, just another overhyped robot that will never make it out of development? And oh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out our recent analysis of GPT-5. It definitely will shock you. And with that being said, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.